Yo, 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 what's up? Long Vlogs back with another video. This is Wacky Wednesday number 10. And today, we are going to be trying, I don't know if we'll be able to, but attempt to see how much ice cream we can eat without having a brain freeze. We only have three, which is like two Reese's flavored Klondike bars and a SpongeBob popsicle. Sorry if I sound off though, guys, because I'm coming through with like a stuffy nose and that kind of stuff, but... I'm hoping I'll get through it soon, but yeah, we're gonna actually save the SpongeBob popsicle for last, and we're gonna start with the Reese's Klondike bars. So let's actually get this open, guys. But the whole point of this is to try and get a brain freeze. You're probably like that sounds stupid. Why would you want to get a brain freeze? Just because I can, and I will, or unless um, me and my mom were talking. We don't know if three ice creams will give me a brain freeze, but we'll try. Here's what it looks like. Um, looks pretty good so far, but let's start. It's not giving me brain freeze, but it's really cold in my teeth. Still no brain freeze, just my teeth. I was trying to start by eating fast, but it's hard without getting your teeth in it and then freezing. So it looks like I'm gonna have to eat a bit slower so that way my teeth won't be hurt. Next time I'm junk. This would have been an easy challenge if it was like trying to freeze my teeth and that kind of stuff, but it's not like that. Which is crappy. One thing I've realized lately, guys, <clears throat> I've been doing a lot, and I mean a lot of food related Wacky Wednesdays. I've been trying to think of not food related, so that way it could be more entertaining than just watching me eat food. But comment any ideas you have, and I might do them. So, yeah, that'll be cool. And I might take some of your guys' ideas and make them from my own. <laughs> my dog's over here and want begging for some ice cream, but yeah, she ain't getting nothing. You can see her tongue just like moving, like. We're about done with the first ice cream and no brown freeze. And you're all probably gonna be like in the comments, hey, you didn't eat fast stuff, that's why he's not getting brain freeze and stuff. Well, thing is, you're right, because you have to eat it really fast to get a brain freeze, but it's hurting my teeth, and I don't really want cavities right now. Well. Yep. Yeah. I don't to beg him. Oh. This is going to get messy.
Mm. My dog's legit on my shoulder right now. Tooth again. Crap. Mm. Finally, she stopped begging. Alright. First thing down. Still didn't get no brain freeze. We still have another Klondike bar and then. A Spongebob popsicle to go, so it's still chances we'll get a brain freeze. But unlikely. The chances of that are slim to none. Um new Klondike bar open. Crap. Crap. But yeah, if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe if you want to see more um, wacky, dumb stuff like this. Gonna make it happen. One thing I'm curious about. If this ice cream is in front of the ring light for like a while, like, would it melt? And I highly doubt that. The reason it would probably melt is because of the heat around, but not the ring light. But now I'm curious, would a ring light melt in ice cream if it was just a cold room with a one ring light shining on it? I don't know, now I'm curious. If a ring light would, um, like basically melt in ice cream. Comment down below what you think, yes or no. If this was a challenge to see if my teeth would hurt, that'd be a pass already, like last ice cream. Mm. I don't know why I was trying to suck up some chocolate. Tastes good though, not gonna lie, I still need no brain freeze. You know what? I'm thinking. I know I'm definitely not gonna get a brain freeze. I don't think I'll finish all this ice cream. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to eat this SpongeBob popsicle. Um I might save it for a different video, like I've already done some SpongeBob popsicle opening to see if it's a perfect one. I might save this for one of those videos, actually. Just gonna finish this Cool and Dice bar. But I'm gonna save that Spongebob Popsicle for a different video, like one of those Spongebob Popsicle opening videos. See if it's perfect or not. I'll do that. 
oops, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna finish this Klondike bar first because I don't waste food. But yeah. I'll probably make the video with this tomorrow. So, look forward to that. I lately been scheduling different times for videos, but tomorrow you'll at least see one thing from me, maybe two. But one of them will be this, don't worry. Ugh. We're almost done. I'm gonna fight through this like warriors. Yeah. Sorry about my dog, guys, but yeah. Just a few more bites of the Klondike bar. But, yeah, um, we ate the Klondike bars, both of them, and as I expected, no brain freeze, but, um, we're gonna save this Spongebob Popsicle, as I said, for a video coming out tomorrow, where we're gonna try and find a perfect one, because I don't think I can eat the rest of this, so, we are gonna be saving this for tomorrow, and making a Spongebob Popsicle opening video with that. So, that way this won't go to waste, and, because I'm also full right now, but, if you did enjoy this video, and you want to see more Wacky Wednesday videos, we have a playlist on the channel with all the Wacky Wednesdays, so make sure to check it out, and then subscribe if you enjoy all that, but as always, peace out. Bye, guys!